there are so many people out here trying to do a show just like this. <laughs> I can't believe you. You're not pretty enough. Do you really think you're talented enough? You think you're talented enough to pull this off? Yeah, your whole family gonna be looking at you like you look stupid. What? You're supposed to be an adult. You're supposed to be going to work, coming home, you know, making some money. Instead, <laughs> you're out here chasing a dream. A fantasy, and you know it's a fantasy. You know it. That's why you call it a dream. You don't even have your gloves laced up. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Bitch, I'm already laced up. I'm about to pummel you. I'm about to beat your ass. You're gonna get smashed today, bitch. And just then, Solace looked right into the piercing stares of the eyes of Misery. And she said, Misery, here we are. Fighting you is <laughs> something where I like to do, you know. And I mean, you're right. I mean, my gloves not even tied up on my hands tight. But guess what? It don't matter whether you beat me or whether I beat you, you know. Because just the fact send me a stand in the list ring against you. I'm already a winner. You see me? <laughs> Even if you beat me, them still are gonna make noise for me. And of course, if I beat you, the people them are gonna make noise same way. So the difficult part, already done. The difficult part was even just stepping into this room against you. So Misery, you're right. And at that moment, Misery knew it was no sense in fighting Solace. For the words of peace knocked the fight right out of Misery. Misery's purpose is to agitate Solace. But no matter how convincing the company of Misery is, it is Solace's job to maintain her sense of being and quiet the voice of her sister. Well, so far, so good.